guys what's up welcome back to my channel I know it's been a long time since I've uploaded a video but today I really wanted to put this one up for you and as you can tell by the title it is a Kagome inspired look um, you know for Halloween or for any other Comic Con or whatever events you guys may go to. If you guys are huge fans of Inuyasha like I am, give this video a thumbs up. I hope you guys do enjoy the video. I know her character doesn't seem like she will wear makeup, but this is just my take of a look that I think that she would wear. It was very fun for me to create this look because who wouldn't want to be Kagome? She falls down this well and gets transported into this world where she meets Inuyasha and yeah. <laughs> I remember the first time I watched the show. Well, actually, I watched one movie. I didn't actually start in this series yet, and I fell in love. I was like into it, and then from there on, I've been a fan ever since. So, hope you guys enjoy. Please give this video a thumbs up if you do, and let's just go ahead and get started. I'm gonna go ahead and prep my face with a Smashbox primer water, and then I'm gonna go ahead and apply the Smashbox pore minimizing primer as well just around where I have more enlarged pores that I need to fill now if you are a big fan of uh, Inuyasha you know that of course she's just an anime character she doesn't she doesn't wear a lot of makeup she's what I can say in between a tomboy and a girl girl in my opinion so I can use a more matte foundation but not too matte and I decided to go with the Fit Me from Maybelline uh, Matte and Poreless. Not quite sure which shade I'm in right now, so I am mixing 128 and 228. So if you guys do watch Inuyasha, leave down below who's your favorite character? Just curious, like, do you like Kagome? Do you like Inuyasha? Do you like Kikyo? It was like one of my favorite animes when I was younger. My best friend actually showed it to me. I fell in love right away. I haven't watched it in a while, but I feel like I kind of want to restart the whole series. I just have like a favorite episode or a favorite movie because I know they came out with quite a bit of movies as well. And yeah, I just think the whole love story with him and Kikyo and Kagome is just, I don't know, I like it. Now that we have the foundation on, I'm gonna go ahead with sealer. I didn't want something too heavy, so I'm gonna go ahead and use my Naked Skin from Urban Decay. And this is in medium light neutral. And I am going to bake, I'm going to go ahead and use my Laura Mercier translucent powder and I'm going to bake under my eyes of course and then use it to set um, all over my face as well. Alright, so we're going to let this sit for a little bit while it bakes. Um, I'm going to go ahead and do my brows. And I'm just going in with my Anastasia Brow Riz in dark brown. This is the best it's going to get. So I'm going to go ahead and just set them with Royal Stylist Brow Pumper. Okay, and we can go ahead and wipe away this thing. Like it's gonna be super easy, super simple. Cause you know, Kagame, she doesn't have time to do her eye makeup. She has to go with Inyasha on adventures, and yeah, who has time for eye makeup when you have to run around in the woods? <laughs> Anyways, we're gonna go ahead and jump into my pure. I think it's Diary Diaries. I got it in my boxy charm. I'm gonna go ahead and add on the crease color. I'm gonna go ahead and go to go into and just pop this right in the crease. Okay, 
And then for the lid, I'm just going to use my flat shader brush and go, go right into private cream. And it's just a matte cream. And just to deepen up the outer crease just a little bit, I am going to go into Epic right here. It's just a dark brown and we're just going to darken up the outer edge a little bit. Alright, and that's pretty much it for the eyes. I am going to add um, eyeliner as well. and. Lashes, but lashes are optional. You don't have to add them, but I am going to so So I am going to line the upper waterline with my Bella Pierre Cosmetics And this is just an ebony and I'm also going to line my bottom Waterline as well and with the, the Rimmel nude eye pencil Lash line I am going to go back into splurge here and just run that right through the bottom lash line. Since I am going with lashes, I'm not gonna go too heavy on mascara, but I am gonna add one coat of the Voluminous Lash Paradise in L'Oreal. And like I said, I am gonna go with falsies and I'm just gonna use my Demi Wispies. Go ahead and contour my face with my Hula Benefit. I'm going to go ahead and bronze as well with my number 7 bronzer and caramel. For a flush of color on the cheek, I'm going to go in with my Wet n Wild and Rose Champagne. And for highlight, I didn't want something too um, blinding, something more natural, so I decided to go in with my Essence Pure Nude and be my highlight. For lip, I'm gonna go in with my Bare Minerals uh, Matte Liquid Lipstick in Friendship. Finally, I'm just gonna set the face with my Too Faced Hangover RX Coconut Setting Spray. Alright, guys, so that completes this easy makeup tutorial for Kagome. And as you can tell, it's just very easy. Um, simple and fast and like I said you can skip the lashes you can skip really anything and just go the way you are because honestly I think for her on her daily adventures she doesn't need to put on makeup so we're gonna go ahead and jump into the outfits as you can see it comes with the skirt and the uniform top and um, I wore a white tank under with some shorts as well because the skirt is pretty short. And the top, it comes with a zipper on the side as well. So it's very easy to put on. And to finish up the outfit, she does have these long white socks. So I purchased uh, the one I have from Target. And she does wear brown shoes. So I just slipped on my Sperry's and yeah. That makes this Kagome outfit complete. Alright guys, so I really hope you did enjoy this tutorial of Kagome for Comic Con or Halloween or for any kind of event. I hope that this look did help you guys. And yeah, like I said, I'll have the exact outfit linked down below. I got it from Amazon. And I would love to know if there's any other um, characters you would love to see or any kind of other Halloween tutorials you would love to see, I will be happy to do that for you guys. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Give it a thumbs up if you guys did. And don't forget to subscribe down below. I'll catch you guys in my next video. Bye!